Hey there, VC Rick here, Rick and Records in the Vinylarium. Well, uh, got some CDs. Uh, listening to uh, Green Day, American Idiot right now, and uh, have had this for quite a while, for years and years and years. And you know, anyway, thought I'd give it a re-listen. But uh, what I wanted to share with you today are uh, some CDs that I just picked up, and I guess it's around twenty. Um, most of them came via eBay. So, uh, let's just get into it and I'll show you. Um, I was really after, <laughs> I was after one CD and, uh, I got that one CD, found that on eBay and typing away, you know, looking at stuff, scrolling and found like, you know, 15 other CDs, uh, that were the right price, you know, cheap. <laughs> so, uh, let's just go from the top here. Um, pick this up, uh, Springsteen chapter and verse. And this is supposed to be like a soundtrack to a, um, I think a Born to Run documentary, if I remember correctly. I know it's the soundtrack to one of his works, but uh, it's a compilation. Born to Run, Badlands, uh, Brilliant Disguise, The River, My Father's House. Uh, you can't judge a book by his... Oh yeah, there's uh, two songs on here uh, from when he was with the Castiles uh, before he, uh, you know, went on out on his own. And uh, joined up with the E Street Band, uh, "Baby" by the Castiles, and you can't judge a book by the cover by the Castiles. Um, a lot of good songs on here, so thought I'd check that out. It was cheap, and then uh, <laughs> here's the one I'll catch hell for: uh, Taylor Swift, "Midnight." This was uh, a separate eBay purchase. Haven't listened to it yet. Don't know if I recognized any of the songs. Not off the top of my head. Nothing. Now, "Sweet Nothing." You're on your own, kid. Maroon, anti-hero. A couple bonus tracks on here. So we'll see if I recognize anything on it. I don't know. Um, oh, yeah. Knocked Loose. Laugh tracks. Uh, before I got this, this came from Amazon, I believe. Um, before I got it, I streamed it. It's killer. It's really good. Um, Oblivion's Peak, The Rain, Blood Will Have Blood, My Heroes, Last Words. Like my friend Josh Hodge said, uh, you can't go wrong with Knock Loose. Good punk. Some uh, Motionless and White, which is kind of like, man, there's a lot of reflection going on. Kind of a, um, the new school of metal, you know, uh, metalcore, grindcore, emo, I don't know. Uh, but, uh, Definitely a lot more uh, shouting <laughs> these days in um, metal music. Uh, to Keep From Getting Burned, Ghost in the Mirror, uh, The Seventh Circle. This is a pretty old album of theirs, 2009. It's uh, When Love Met Destruction is the name of the album. So we'll check that one out. Also streamed this before I got it. Also got this from Amazon. Sebastian Bach, Child Within the Man. And I uh, listened to this a couple times, like cutting the grass and stuff before I ever came in the mail. A uh, song like F You, uh, Crucify Me, Failure, uh, Future of Youth, About to Break, Everybody Bleeds. It does not sound anything like a Skid Row album or anything. It doesn't even sound like Sebastian Bach's singing voice. It sounds completely different. It's not bad. It just sounds completely different. Uh, Notice and Victim, Tipping the Scales. I believe this is a uh, Christian punk band. So much glare. Uh, forward, cast down, dead weight. Mr. Philosophy called before the storm. Check that out. Checking them all out. Uh, the Blamed, give us Barabbas. And I think this was like a post-punk band, Christian post-punk band. So to pray, prayer for the dead, positive, instrumental. Anyway, this guy, I was looking for this one particular Christian metal album uh, from way back, 1990, 91 maybe. Um, and this guy had just a slew of other like Christian hard rock, punk, some hip hop. And I was like, ah, what the heck? Let's see what we got here. Maybe we'll find some new music to listen to. Let me show you the one that I was really after. If I can find it in the mix here. Here it is. This is the one I was really after. Dreamer. Full metal racket. Kind of like a docking type of vibe. Um, the cover song. Not cover song. Titles track. Don't... Um, full Metal Racket is awesome. Crying, Don't Stop Now. Thank you, Lord. What year was this? Yep, 91. Excellent, excellent, excellent album. So I was really stoked to get that back in the collection. I used to have it back in 91, 92. 
and I don't know what happened. Well, actually, I still had the CD, but I didn't have the case, so now I got both. And some Christian uh, thrashy, death metal -y goodness, mortification, power, pain, and passion, 10 years, 1990 to 2000. And these guys have been around forever. So you got human condition, toxic shock, Satan's doom, monks of the high lord, illusion of life, uh, bonus tracks uh, that are done uh, acoustically, including grind planetarium, standing at the door of death. So mortification. Used to listen to them a little bit way back when. Midnight Orchestra, Digital Savior. I don't remember what kind of music this is. I believe, I want to say in goth, like goth metal, goth rock, goth metal. Uh, the Only One, Digital Savior, uh, I'm a Lie, uh, Pay to Pay, No More Monsters. A lot of, uh, a lot of songs featuring other artists, including uh, Lisa Hamill, Wedding Party, uh, Man of War, E-Rock. Never heard of any of these people. So we'll check it out. And then uh, so we've got quite a few comps. Uh, Stadium Jam. This has got uh, Audio Adrenaline, OC Supertones, Big Tent Revival, who is awesome live. Saw them open for uh, Jeff Moore in the distance back in like 95. Um, they were with uh, Plank Eye. Anyway, uh, they, they sound like they're a folk band when you hear them on an album. It was a hard rock concert. It was pretty cool. Sonic Floods on here. So just a little comp of Christian bands. This is another comp, Fire It Up. This one's got uh, Cutlass on there, um, Seventh Day Slumber, Emery, Amberlin, Project 86, Thousand Foot Crutch, which is an awesome band. We'll check them out. Metatonia, Don't Walk Dead. Uh, I think this was Christian death metal, which just sounds funny to say out loud, Christian death metal. So what's on here? First the kingdom, pay, don't walk dead, buy his word. Bonus tracks are on here too. A lot of bonus tracks on these CDs. Fan mail 2000. I want to say this was punk also. Uh, Pulp Fiction, Good Old Times, Breakdown, Time Will Only Tell. Kind of a cool album cover uh furthermore albums called she and i this is hip-hop we'll see how good of hip-hop it is uh we need to talk happy oh so happy it's scary fall on me and christian hip-hop uh this is oh yeah this is adam again adam again has been around a long time this was from 99 but uh, they go way back. Uh, this is selected songs from Adam again. Worldwide favorites. And I guess it's probably a comp of uh, like a greatest hits thing, right? Sleepwalk, River on Fire, Relapse, Homeboys, uh, Dig, and a song called Stone. We'll give that a listen. Who's this? Oh, this was a freebie that the guy, when I bought these from eBay from this one seller, all the Christian stuff, he just threw this in. I know the name, but I don't know any of their music. It's a EDL, Moment of Clarity, and this one needs a new case. It's got some cracking on the front there, but EDL, uh, Let It Ride, Endurance Never Fails, Sunshine, Incline, Big Casino, The Choice Is Yours. I love it when they clearly type out the song lyrics so you can actually read them and don't do them in a crazy font. Lost Dogs, the best of Lost Dogs. They've been around a long time, too. Christian, like, alternative rock. Uh, Bad Indigestion, The New Physics, uh, No Ship Coming In, I Can't Say Goodbye, Imagine That, Rocky Mountain Mines, Scenic Routes. They've got street cred. They've been around. Global Wave System, Life Equals Death. I want to say this was uh, metal of some sort. It's really hard to see that one. Like equals death. It's only natural. Death stroke to youth. X. Uh, to sink. It was, it was born there. Soul like ice. You know, I wonder if this is a 93. Okay. I wonder if this is like from, like a Asian of some sort uh, band. Because there's a lot of strange writing here but also some of the lyrics or not lyrics but the um song titles seem like they might be 
um, from another country or something, just the way they're phrased. The Worship 2007 CD, you see this everywhere. You can get this for 50 cents. I think I paid a little bit more than that. Uh, bands like Starfield are on here, Cutlass, um, Under Oath, Hawk Nelson, Reliant K, Delirious. Got backstage passes to Delirious for free when they came in concert. Uh, we were last in line, and an AM radio host came over and asked us if we wanted to meet the band. I mean, we were dead last in line, and we went right, right up to the front, met the band behind the stage there, and got to sit in the front row. So, Which wasn't a huge deal. It was in a gigantic church, not like it was in a stadium or anything. And then uh, Christian Music's Worship. This was part of like a four-pack free, or not four-pack freebie, but a four-pack that was dirt cheap. Uh, it's got Hillsong on here, Newsboys. Starfield, like Cutlass, Cutlass is on all of these. Uh, Tim Hughes, News Voice puts on a pretty good concert. Well, they did back in the day. I don't know much about them. I haven't followed them in years. All right, and then last two. Okay, that's all the ones from that one seller. And then I got this, 10 years. You know, some uh, prog, prog rock, prog hard rock. You never know what you're going to get with 10 years. Uh, Luna, name of our dog. Uh, Chris, Crimson Kiss, Ashes, Survivors, Moisture Residue. What I've heard of these guys, I've really liked. And last but not least, this one is uh, probably surprised some people, but uh, it's actress Kate Hudson and her album Glorious. Now, Kate's been promoting this thing all over, and um, she has a surprisingly, well, maybe not surprised. I mean, she's a talented actress. Obviously, she's got talent, but she's got a really good voice, and the song's are pretty decent. Um, good pop to just kind of crossing the line into some rock even. Uh, Romeo, uh, not easy to know, glorious, touch the light, live forever, the 90s. So I'm looking forward to giving the rest of this a listen. And that is all the new CDs that I'm adding over here to my uh, 1,650, ah, we're dropping stuff, 1,650 uh, CDs on the rack and there's one row right there is the other one so uh yeah we'll add those in there squeeze them in somehow also uh just because they're here and handy just got done listening to some jethro tall what an iconic album i mean some people might say it's been played to death you know what that's probably your own fault because they only play one or two songs on the radio and uh just finished up the best of the loving spoonful right before putting on green day so do you believe in magic but well, this is a great band loving spoonful anyways y'all good time to give the voice a rest i'll see you when i see you thanks for watching oh and please by the way subscribe i'm gonna make some more videos i don't know when but i'm going to uh so hit the notification bell hit likes leave comments love comments talk to you later Bye bye